your stuff. Take it. Hey, what's up, my foodies? Welcome back to the eatery with your girl, Kiana. I have my soon-to-be ex-husband, <laughs> Lawrence. <laughs> I swear. Hey, hi to the people. Hi, people. Uh, so. So, uh, we are in the car <laughs> because Nyla is at... Oh, this look good. Oh, sorry, people. <sighs> Nyla is at acting class. And we can't go in, and uh, it's for two hours, so it makes no sense for us to drive home um, and turn right around and come back out. So we thought we'd do a Taco Bell mukbang in the car to car, kill some time. Car bomb. So what we're going to do is do a prayer, thumbnail, and get it in. Before we do that, I think I'm going to switch it up. I want to ask you guys to please like, comment, and subscribe, and hit the notification bell so when I post a video, you're notified. And I remind you again at the end of the video. You want to pray, baby? Guess not. <laughs> Lord, thank you for this food we're about to eat. For the nourishing of our body, we ask that you bless it and give us the nourishing that we need. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. So let's do a thumbnail. I'm, I'm just gonna grab the bag like this. I have nachos. One, two, three. All right. Look at you doing multiple faces. Go ahead, baby. I mean, your your daddy. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> try, my daddy to, try to show us how to do it. I guess I gotta leave it up here so y'all can see it. And I got extra beef and no, um, oh, they are sloppy. and no, uh, it's sloppy beans. So I got, oh, okay, go ahead. I got two chalupas and a crunch wrap supreme, right? This is good. I oh, did do look good. Mm. For reals. What you say before? I don't want on nachos. You know you're going to eat some anyway. No, you ain't gonna give me some anyway, cause yeah. your eyes big in your stomach. <laughs> I'm gonna put this down here. And I'm hungry, people. Am I? Pan your beef. This was a dollar. That's a dollar? This is a dollar, people. Let's see. So, go I think grab let me some, just pop it. Some fire. I think if you get something, fire. And you say like no beans or something, and you bought, but you want extra meat, they shouldn't charge you for that. All right, but you still gotta. I mean, it's meat. But they be skeet on it anyway. So if I'm not getting a, a side, I'm sorry, folks. They're keeping their beef. I mean, they're keeping their beans. And giving me... I just squirted that out on this side. What? On this uh, thing. Yeah, I'm in my car today, so... I can't mess mess nothing up. My truck is in the shop. Lauren's truck is getting fixed. Come on, babe. It's not that um, uh, not major though. Need some more. You want to put the bag right there? It's gonna be in the way. I'm gonna say yes on the boss court. I really don't have a conversation, so this video may be all over the place. But why I'm thinking of divorce court.
would y'all go on divorce court if they paid y'all some money or said y'all have to say other things that wasn't true? That's how, that's how it is. The, I know. That's how it is now. Just for the drama effect. So you may have real problems that you want to discuss and get the judge feedback or help or assistance or whatever on. But they may say, y'all too boring. Can y'all say this or that to make it more interesting? I don't know if I'll do that. Is it worth it? It depends. Like, how much they went to pay? I don't know. Let's say it was, because you know they film in Atlanta now. So if it was $1,500. 1500 to say what? I don't know. So, y'all, I think my only gripe with my. You loud. Oh, I'm sorry. I think my only gripe with my husband would be this day on video game. What? Whatever you said. You ate the other one? No, I just ate one chalupa and I'm about to pull this crunch wrap like that looks sloppy. And my husband's not on social media. So what if they said, you act like we had an issue with Dang, you being on social media too much or me or vice versa? Oh, I wouldn't do it because that's a lie. Because I'm, I'm not really on social media, so. Or... That you be going out in the club entertaining. <laughs> I know that's a lie. <laughs> a lot of people who know us know that's a lie. But that'll make for good ratings on TV. But that doesn't make, make it make, make you look bad. I mean, not just you, I mean one, one of us. But it's usually always the husband that make it, they may always make the husband look bad. No. There's some ratchet girls out there. No, no. Not, not to like, I wouldn't do it if it's going to mess up my character. No. Because if I don't do that stuff, I'm not going to say I, I do it on national television just for a check. But you'll be on TV. But then the whole world would think that I bounce club to club and go at the top and stuff. No, I ain't, I ain't down for that. Hmm. We would better go in there like that because if we don't have serious problems, we're too boring. We go to work. And then technically, come home. When we have serious problems, we always wind up talking it out anyway. You know, ain't no wrong when people going to seek counseling. Is that what would you consider? Would you consider that counseling? Not really. Me? I would. You know what I'm talking about? Like divorce court. Like, you know, people rarely go on there and get, end up getting a divorce. But that's not technically... I don't think that's technically counseling. I wonder... When the cameras are off, do they talk to them about their real issues? I don't, I don't know. Mm. It's just it's just weird that like because every time I see you watching it and I actually like pay attention to it, 
It's always the dude that does something wrong. Mm-mm. Maybe one or two. This is good. I'm hungry. Could be a little bit, bro. Hmm. Could be a little bit, bro. Probably. We need something to do. I don't need Saturday. Because sitting in the car waiting for night for two hours for the birds. We had to do this now? Well, the good thing is that they're doing hybrid. So right now, she only comes to lo the location once a month. The other days are still virtual. Oh, okay. So. Yeah, but it'll suck. Especially trying to come up here and try to eat some Popeyes and... Oh, yeah. Pop out line wrapped around the building. So, Taco Bell was not my first choice. There's a Popeye's right up the street. And so, we decided, leaving home, we'll get Popeye's, do a Popeye's video. I haven't done one yet. So, we passed it, and my husband said, oh, I'm good. Sloppy. Ain't nobody over there. So we come over here, drop mine off. Not even five minutes. Not back even up there. five minutes. It wasn't even three minutes. Head back up there. And this what? Eight cars? Cars wrapped around the building already. I'm like, dang. So then, and none of them all them empty. So then, the line ain't moving at all. So I asked Lawrence, is the inside open? He said, yeah. Because I saw a sign that said, we are open. And I figured that that's what it meant. So the dining room was open. So I was like, yeah. Let's go inside. So I got off the line to go. And the dining room closed, door was locked. So now three cars and pulled up where I was at. So I'm like, no. So I said, okay. What could we eat? So Taco Bell, Taco Bell it is, but check this, I'm going to go eat the Taco Bell and come back, drive past the Popeyes, those same cars sitting there, and now it's about six more cars all the way out to the street, so that line is not moving at all, and that same truck that was behind me was still there. In the same spot. So I'm glad we got out the line this when we got Taco Bell. So I would do a Popeye's eventually. Ooh my hand burning. Don't feed my shirt. Hmm. Don't feed my shirt. Mm-hmm. So I think this is gonna be a quick video. You wanna end it? Yeah. Thank you guys for hanging out with us. We're gonna continue to eat and wait for Nyla. So once again. Please, or oh, I'll finish eating because he's done. <laughs> Hit that like button, subscribe, and the notification bell. So the next time I post a video, you're notified. Till next time, peace. peace.